everyone and welcome back to another episode, a long-awaited episode of Jurassic World the Game. <laughs> a long overdue one, actually, because uh, there was a new boss and um, there, there was loads of updates over Christmas. And I just like, one, I, I'm like ill now, so I'm sort of nursing a cup of tea with me. Yes, that's right. The cup of tea traverses, tra traverses uh, games and series. And uh, there's a boss in this one. Also, if we look at the news, um, I was going to actually sing this, but sorry, I'm, I'm not feeling up to it. <laughs> but we got a free um, Ethereum from um, the 12 Days of Exodus. So it turns out it was not a Megalania. I'm very annoyed about it because that was a lizard step. I don't care what you say. That freaking thing was a lizard. <laughs> but well, free of Ethereum, I can't really complain about that. Uh, also, for the first time ever, an Indominus Rex pack. Like, really? <laughs> okay. Only, you want to know how much it is? Only 9999. A <laughs> hundred quid. Oh my god, I hope, I hope. Well, maybe somebody did get it for Christmas. Uh, some kid. But I'm just going to tell you straight up. It ain't worth it. A hundred pound. Jesus. Anyway, uh, we'll co collect the DNA, collect the food. Also, the biggest news, and the reason why we're recording this video, oh, excuse me, <laughs> is the ma Maelstorm? Malastorm 08. Defeat the Malastorm 08 to protect your park. Ooh, okay, so this is the new boss. I actually thought I was going to miss it. People were like, play the boss, play the boss, it's almost done, it's halfway. Um, and I haven't, like, opened this game at all since, uh, for two days. So, because I took Christmas off and I took, um, uh, what else did I take off? I took Christmas off and Boxing Day off, that's right. Two days! Two days and they drop things. Ooh, I dig that. Uh, anything else good? Uh, could be worth it, but I'll save that gold for something else. Uh, also, ooh, if there's an opportunity to trade anything for VIP points, even if it's, uh, apart from bucks, if it's DNA, food, coin, whatever, I will do it. Because I'm after VIP points now. Um, because the only things I don't have cost VIP points, or, to be honest, I've got loads of other dinosaurs that I can sell if I need DNA, so DNA is not, uh, what I'm wanting at the moment. But let's have a look. Is it finished? Is it completed? All right, we've got 12 billion points to get. All right, that's 3 billion points. Oh! Who oh, said we're halfway there? We ain't even halfway there, you big liar. Hmm. Right, so let's challenge the deer. Oh, ooh, I thought you you had Titanoboa. I saw a YouTube thumbnail that had Titanoboa versus Maelstorm. You big fibber. <laughs> I was all ready to do the thumbnail for it and everything. Ah, oh, well, um, oh wait, hold on, you can, right? Oh, it's a mix. Ah, there you go, that's the one, okay. So, you can use- Ooh, this is the first boss you can use multiple different, uh, like, types. Well, I mean, like, you know, glacier and, uh, land types. So, what's best? Uh, Titanoboa? First? Just because it nerfs it instantly. You know, we'll use Titanoboa, and then we just have to use Segnosuchus and Udon. They don't nerf it, but they're just gonna be better than a woolly mammoth, which is equal, and below Titanoboa, Really, there is nothing else to choose from the Glacier Squad. So it has to be Titanoboa. Okay, let's see it. Ooh! Oh, yeah, there you go. That's more like... Oh, this is awesome. So we got a new arena for the first time ever. No, really. <laughs> oh, it only does 74 attack. It does nothing. It is huge, though. I know Titanoboa is big, but this thing's huge. Okay, I'm going to go for the reserves here. That's what I'm going to go for. It's very dark. They might have made it... They, sh they could have made it a little bit lighter. It's really dark. Okay. I'm going to say he can't kill me really no matter what he does with 74 attack. does have a lot of health, though. Ooh. Again, it's sporting like the purple... Um, oh, God. Oh, wow. Titanoboa didn't flinch at all there. It was like, Maelstorm used magnitude! Magnitude 1. <laughs> Alright, let's go for one attack. Oh, we killed it! Go, Titanoboar! Um. Oh, down it goes. How does it get up again? Is it going to fly up? Oh, no, it doesn't! Well, apart from the back legs. It got up realistically, apart from the back legs, which seemed to just go... Whoop, and spring to life. Okay, Titanoboa, come on, we got this. And I guess you could probably do the glitch with this as well, like we've seen with all the bosses. Um... 
if you exit out and exit in, they always go for like a certain attack. Oh, goes for five. Mm. Oh, Titanobo didn't like that one. Okay. Um, you know what? I think he went for an all-out attack. Oh, he didn't. Bollocks. Oh, no. It's still going to take uh, two hits to kill him. Oh, that's not good. Okay, I should pay more attention. I know, I'm going to pay more attention. Come on, this is for some sweet, sweet DNA. Ooh, lovely. Come on, six. What's he going to go for? Goes for... Oh, no. He might go for eight. But at this point, it's okay. I'm going to go for four reserve, four block. Yeah, he's got eight. I thought so. But let's see what his eight attack is. Oh, okay. Ooh. Is there any need for me to go for any block? Um, well, I mean, was, uh, any, like, extra block? Not really. I'm just gonna see what he does. He's gonna do it eventually. Right, okay, there's six. Takes the hit again. Um, so we, we have to go for four. So one, two, kills him. Factor in two, and then I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna do that just in case he didn't. But he did, so that's all right. Ah, uh, Titanomo takes it down again! Uh, now let's have a look at that getting up on him. Okay, that's good, good, good. And then, <laughs> the back legs just fly. I mean, you could argue he's using his front legs to lift himself, but you don't see him put his weight on his front legs. You don't see his body lean forward. Anyway, that, that's my perspective, anyway. I don't know. I don't do animation for a living. <laughs> but I can critique... Crit what? Critique it, though. Right, three. Ooh. Oh, that does a lot of damage. Ooh. Okay. Um. Jesus. Please tell me that's all of his attack. Ah, one away. Oh, he's got tired in a knot. Can you tie it in a knot? Can you tie it in a bow? Right, okay. Uh, he can kill me if he wants to. But he's not going to. Now, Segnosaurus. Or Segnosuchus, sorry. Is it Segnosuchus? I think it's Segnosuchus. Has like 6,000 attack, maybe? Oop, but, oh, but he just survived. Okay, that time was an all-out attack. Uh, I think, I think so. I think it is, was it? Yeah, it was. Awesome. Titanobo takes it to level four. Not bad. Now, I'm really glad that Titano... No, it, it, yeah, as you see, he lifts up from both legs. He pushes up from his front ones and from his back ones, which you can't do if you've got no back legs to lean on. Anyway, anyway. Uh, Segna Suchus. Yeah, it's good that Titanobo went out first, just to nerf his initial attack to get him to this point. Uh, oh! Whoa! That was awesome! That was- I still need to see, like, his, uh, his ult. <laughs> but that was really cool. That was a nice animation. I wonder if that's, like, normal animation, though, for a deer, because I haven't fought any of them. Uh, oh, it goes for three. Here it is again. whoop -ah! I'm blocking. Why is my Titanobo acting like it hurts? It shouldn't. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go for the same again. He's gonna he's gonna mess up eventually. Yeah, that's it, I think. He's only got four. Come on, go for four. Go for four. Ooh! He loves that. Really does. Now the thing is, if it is a reindeer, it must be a female reindeer. Because the male reindeers in the winter shed their horns, I think. Something like that. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not qualified to talk about that. Uh, should we go for an all-out attack? Please don't block. Yes! Oh, but we didn't kill it. <gasps> oh, Titanobolo looks awesome. Oh, that looks great. Slithering in from the back there, from the shadows. Ooh. And we're dead in one hit. So we'll probably go for one hit. <laughs> but Titanobo did amazing. Oh, no! Oh, come on, Segna Suchus. You got this, buddy. Uh, I'm going to have to go for a lot of block, though, just in case. And it's a good job I did as well. <laughs> oh, my voice is going. Oh, God. Um, oh, oh, I take the hit. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's all good. It's all gravy. I think Segna Suchus is going to die. Uh, it's going to be up to you, Don. You, Don's going to be one to stay in. Come on, go go for like one or two. Oh, okay, that's fine. We, oh, look at that. Well, it's not 6,000 attacks, 4,666. Uh, still pretty good. Wait, he's going to have seven? Yeah, he's got seven. Oh, that's okay. That's okay. 
We can do this. We can do this. Oh, this looks great. I love the arena and the lights and everything. It's nice. Oh, what fun it is. Go for seven. Ah, oh, it goes for four. Come on. I'm, I blocked successfully. What do you mean? Why are you acting like it hurt you? Everyone's freaking drama queens. <laughs> what, what's he got? Okay, six. If he goes for six, we're dead. He goes for, wow, is he stuck? I don't think he is. I don't think he is stuck. Um, one, two, one, two, three, four. And that. Let's see that. Oh, oh, he's dead. Okay. Right, so on to level five. And whoop. <laughs> yeah, he puts all his weight on his right uh, front uh, leg, which wouldn't work. Oh my god, is he stuck? He's, he seems to always be stuck on four. Um, one, two. You know what? I'm going to go for that if he is stuck on four. Let's see if he... Because uh, I, I can take one hit. Yeah, he's stuck on four. Yeah. <laughs> oh, she... One, two, three, four. One, two. Actually, if he is stuck on four, I can't gain anything. Oh, okay. Now he's on three. Right. It's going to really be up to you, Don, here, I think. Uh, go for that and go for that. Come on. Come on. Come on. Don't die. I feel like I'm going to die, though. He's went for four and three. Goes to three and one is just enough. No. I have less attack, but I do have the health. Okay. Um, what should we go for? I'm, I'm tempted to go for four block, four reserve. You know what? That's the safest bet. I think we may be able... It's got 99,000 health. I was going to say, maybe we get level six, but I don't think so. Ooh, did not... He did not freaking hit me. <laughs> I'm going to go for two just in case. Okay, one hit. Not bad. Just a, just a little pin prick, but it's okay. It's okay. Okay, goes for one. Right. I like that. He's got really cool attacks. He looks really stocky. Can you imagine this battle in real life? It's like the Valley of Gwangi, except for without cowboys and and a, and a huge deer instead. <laughs> okay, I uh, see that didn't hurt me though. Apparently. Um, so one, two, three, four, one, two. Yeah, how about that? How about that? We go for four hits. Push! 23,000 damage. Okay. Oh, God! I think he had six. Oh, no. Hoppa! Gonna feel that one. Okay, okay. Things went from good to bad. He's got five. He's got five. Okay, go for five, please. Or four. Four is good. Yes, go for four. That's awesome. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna go for three block and three reserve. That's what I'm gonna go for here. Yes, he did block. He's on four. Okay, worst case, we get hit by one. I like the way these guys, like, measure up. Cinematically, it looks really nice, like, framing. It's gorgeous. Um, I'm gonna go for four block, three reserve, just in case, because I don't know what he's gonna do here. Oh, he's got six! What is he gonna do? Oh, there it is! I still haven't seen his, like, full-on animation leak. Okay, we are taking some pretty big hits here. Um, I'm gonna go for that. I'm gonna go for that. Okay, go for four. Please go for four. Oh, and he goes for two. I can't take three hits. I can't take three hits. Um, oh, man, I'm kind of stuck. Oh, no! No! Oh, no, there's one hit. That's okay. I can take another hit. I can take another hit. Right, so... Um, one, two, three. One, two, three. Four? Yeah! I think, I think I'm safe. More damage. Okay, there you go. Ooh, yeah, I thought he had five. I thought so. Oh, it goes for four. Oh, it could be over. I just want to see, like... Ah! Uh, I don't think we're going to survive. 
Oh, hold on. He's got four again, right? Yeah. Go for three. Or four. Four's okay. Oh, no. That's... You see, that's what I don't like when he does that. I don't like when he does that. Um, should I go for five block? I'm going to go for four. Please don't go for... Oh, he's going to have seven. He's going to have seven. He's got, he's got to go for full on seven. But at least we get to see it. Yes. Okay, what's the ultimate attack? Oh, that was awesome. And unfortunately, <laughs> you don't die. Oh, damn. That was good, though. We did 158,000 damage and got 1,700 DNA. Um, I kind of want to do that again. Um, but that is the best team we can do. I don't think there's a way we could do better than that. I don't think so. So for one last go, you know what? I'm gonna put I'm gonna put Titanoboa in last. That's what I'm gonna do. Where is it? <laughs> Where to go? Yeah, let's let's see if this makes a difference. I'm curious. So I just realized this whole time I've been recording with my headphones on completely, and what I like to do is have one ear out so I can hear how I sound. And I, I just realized I've probably been yelling. <laughs> Oh my god! Because, <laughs> like, I can't really hear myself. You see, that's, that's one of the weird things you've got to get used to when you record yourself. Or at least recording in general. Um, is how loud you, <laughs> you are. <laughs> like, I guess I've just been yelling. Okay, two hits takes it out. That's good. Now, let's see if putting Yudon in first makes a difference. Because I guess Titanoboa would nerf the, like, the higher attack. Which is good. The only problem is that Titan... Look, and... In comparison to Yudon and Segnasuchus, uh, Titana Boa doesn't really have that much attack. Oh, God, four block. That's a whole thousand less than um, Yudon and almost two or three thousand less. Oh, God, than, um, uh, than Segnasuchus. Okay, that was an all-out attack, right? That had to be. I'm going to go for four reserve. Yeah, okay. But Yudon does have the health. So even though we're not nerfing uh, early on male storm 08 attack, we do have like loads more health. So we're on through. We got I think we got to level four, didn't we? Before it died. Um, I think that's what happened. Please go only go for one block. Yes, <laughs> we got to level four. <laughs> oh, right, that was so quick. Now I think Titanoboa um, got. Almost to level five. It went for like seven, didn't it? I think it went for seven. Oh, six. I think he's dead. I think so. Yeah, he's dead. Okay, right. But that's that's oh, that's okay. That's okay. He went for like six, didn't he? Out of his seven. So, um, worst case scenario, he has five. So I'm gonna go for two block. Okay, he has four. That's great because we're gonna be on eight, and we have loads of attack here. So much. Oh, a herbivore in the Cenozoic versus a herbivore in the play, the Plasticine era. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Oh, please don't. Yes, yes, we got it. Awesome. Oh, could have went for two reserve, but uh, he's dead. Okay, I think we needed to get him to level six, didn't we? That's what we needed to do, and I don't think we're gonna get him to level six. He's got eight. Yeah, definitely not gonna happen. Goes for four. Whoobush. Nerf that attack. Okay. Oh, there's a skeleton in the background as well. Okay, so one, two, and one, two, three. Yes, that's good. He went from loads of block. He's only got five. Come on, come on. Yeah, and he went for two. He's got a possibility of having seven on the next go. So if that's the case... One, two, three... Oh, God. Um, I, you know what? I'm going to risk the biscuit. I'm going to go for four reserve. He's only got six. That's good. Which means he can hit me for three, which is probably going to do 3,000 damage. Okay, he goes for five. All right. He's got one block. Ooh, <laughs> he's got one block. Um, I'm going to do... I'm going to do that. And then I could go for that. I'm going to go for that. Okay, he did go for the one block. <laughs> it did nothing. <laughs> it is nothing. Okay, go go for four. Oh, it goes for one. All right. Please go for loads of block though. 
I just want, I just want to, like, go for eight. But the thing is, I'll only do, like, 40,000 damage. Um. Yeah, we're dead. I think we're dead here. Wait, if he goes for seven. Oh, he goes for six. No, oh, please tell me you can survive another. Oh, oh, maybe. I, I could have easily checked that, but I forgot. I didn't even look at the damage he did. Um. Okay, that's good. Can we survive two? Oh, no, we can't survive two. We can't survive. Don't go for four. Don't go for four. Ah, oh, for God's sake. No! <laughs> no. Okay. I'm gonna say that it's probably best to put in... Um, oh, we did about the same amount of damage, actually. That's 137,000. And our best was 158,000. So we, we only did 20,000 extra damage the other way. Um, so I'd probably say that putting in Titanoboa is better because it, it gets to use its uh, its nerf bonus pretty well because early on his attack which is you know barely there is not even there it's it's halved and Titanoboa can do more damage and kill it quicker whereas Udon's taken quite big hits early on uh, which is better for later on when um, it has you know quite good attack as well uh, yeah, so, ooh, that was awesome. Okay, let's see what events we got. Um, so yeah, if there's ever any way for me to... We got 11. Is there 11? Why is there 11 missions? Oh, bonus missions. Start one, Gyrosphere two. Nah, I'm okay. Yeah, like, what? ooh, and also the lottery. <gasps> what do we get? Seven, ooh, I traded food for this, I think. And three, uh, so it's 120 DNA. Eh, it could be better. What's the next one? Scappers. For 100 VIP points, not worth it. Like, they did have Metapasaurus in that um, legendary, oh, sorry, the VIP slot for the lottery. And you can only get Metapasaurus in the 50,000 uh, pack. And it was like 130 to enter. So I was like, if I if I spend 2,600 2, VIP points to enter and I win one Metapasaurus... I've saved like 40 odd thousand VIP points on a, like that I would have spent to buy it in a pack guaranteed. So sometimes I think that's what that's that's good actually. I didn't end up winning the Metapasaurus in it. I won other stuff, which is a bit disappointing. So I did waste 2,600 uh, VIP points, but the, ch the, the, the the chance was there. It's a lottery at the end of the day. Um, but yeah, I'm doing a lot of the Raptor um, things now at the moment because I have a chance of winning a pack in there, and I don't mind about DNA, because if I really need, if a new dinosaur comes out, and I really need to have DNA, I can just sell, I know, the Super Kool-Aid, because there's no point in having a level one, I may as well sell it, and at this point, I'm actually not bothered about level 40, level 30, level 20, level 10. If there is a level 20 or a level 30 there, I won't sell it, just because I did spend resources on them uh, to get them to level 30 or level 20. So like the T-Rex, I won't sell the level 30. It sells for 7,500, but I, I, it's not worth it because I spent food, uh, like getting it to level 30 and books and probably DNA to um, get it, like to like merge them together. So uh, yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this video, that was pretty fun. Uh, it was nice to see a new environment and new animations because I don't think I've ever faced the deer. Um, I don't think I'm gonna win the, um, something just ended. It just clocked over now, I saw that. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna win the Gastronosis just because, uh, what's a, G Gastornis, sorry. G Gastronosis! Gastornis, because, um, yeah, 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 I could do the Shake the Earth. Yeah, so let's do the Shake the Earth. Um, do that one, that one, that one, there you go. So we'll win a super rare pack, if anything. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna do the, ga I, Maybe if I've got time, <laughs> but like as soon as this episode's um, like stop recording, I'm gonna edit it, set it up to render, and record something else. I'm gonna record, I don't know, and it's probably gonna be up after this video as well. So um, if you like fish that like to eat and also grow, you might like that video. <laughs> uh, so yeah, oh, is my tea cold? Hmm. Oh, it's kind of in that lukewarm area where it's not nice and it's not too, it's like it's not hot enough to be nice and it's not cold enough to be nice. It's all like meh. Right, okay, we can do this. We we can we can easily win the super rare pack. I want the VIP points. It's what I spend real goddamn money on. The only reason I have a, a VIP membership. So oh four block, okay. I'm not worried about this. Uh, every time I've done the stampede, it's been yeah, fairly easy because I do have really strong dinosaurs. Oh, sorry. 
None of these are dinosaurs, they're, they're reptiles. <laughs> yeah, let's go for two. Oh, come on! Well, you know what? You're just gonna make it harder, because I've got to kill you. Oh, five. Wow, okay. Ooh! One more, and he oh, might have almost killed me, actually. So one, and then one extra, because I think he's pro- You know, two, just in case. Yeah, I thought he had a block. Okay, what a- so I hope you guys have, because this is the first episode um, back. I should have said this at the start. I'm so sorry. I hope you guys have had a lovely, happy Christmas. I used to be one of those people like, why do people say happy Christmas? It should, it's always merry, uh, politically correctness. And now I'm like, whatever, man. <laughs> I don't care. Because there was one song that was on um, on TV. It's like, who took the merry out of Christmas? And I'm like, well, you know, happy is happy. I mean, merry, you don't say merry for anything else. That's why I liked merry. But honestly, each to their own. I'm too old. I can't be bothered. <laughs> you say whatever you want. Oh, God. So one, one, two, three. I had a great Christmas. Uh, took the day off. Spent it with the family. Didn't do any work. Um, and I'm, I hope you guys, well, for anyway, didn't go on YouTube and just spent time with uh, the people that are important to you. Um, I think I did a, did I do a poll or anything? No, I, I, I tweeted. That's right. I tweeted. Uh, saying that, um, hope you guys have a Merry Christmas and whatnot. Uh, hope you had a Merry Christmas, whatever. <laughs> uh, and then I took Boxing Day off as well, because I just spent the day, um, because Whitney's off from work. Uh, I was like, you know what, Whitney's off, it's very rare that she gets holidays. Um, so why not spend the day with her? It was lovely. We play, we, we play board games all day. <laughs> well, no, we, no, sorry. We did some, um, it was like, um... Uh, it was like a kazoo Disney game where you have to do the tunes. But there was... Like, you think about Disney, right? The amount of songs they have in those movies. There was nothing... There was like barely any in there. There was like five from Toy Story. I want you to name five songs from the original Toy Story movie that isn't You've Got a Friend in Me. There was one where it was like... Yeah, exactly, you can't. <laughs> there was one song that was... Um, it was Toy Story and... Go sailing. It's that song where Buzz Lightyear tries to fly and he jumps off and kills himself, basically. <laughs> and all I can remember is that bit where it's like, I could fly if I wanted to, like a bird in the sky. I believe I could fly. No, no, no. And there was another one which was like, um, oh, do the tune for To Infinity and Beyond. And I was like, all I can think of is that bit where Buzz goes, To Infinity and Beyond. And Woody's like, ah -ha! You can fly! This isn't flying, it's falling with style. And I was like, I can't remember what the song is. I just remember them flying over the truck and it going... Did it, did it, did it, did it. <laughs> so I was like, oh, okay. Who, whoever designed that? I was like, <laughs> there's so many choices. There was like nothing from um, Mulan, like... Good, like, oh, you gotta be swift like a sorry river. You know, there's nothing in there. It was like, why is that five Toy Story songs that nobody knows? Anyway, that's that's my uh, two cents for the day. Ooh, we could get into him. You know what? No, no. Um, oh, there's so many. Ooh, level, oh, level 27 in Dominus Rex. Ooh. <laughs> I like that's paired with Ichthyo staying here. I kind of want to do that though. Should we do that? Should we make an extra long go? And I love you guys. I don't want to leave you just yet. Um. Right, so we put in Suchopterus, which is probably going to bring in Indominus, and you know what, at the moment, it's pretty easy sailing. <gasps> Counteraptor for free? Oh, Christmas came early! Uh, and also... Uh. Oh, go for that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I got gas! Hmm. Oh yeah, and also some people tweeted at me images of them, um... Uh, getting uh, toast, and I was like, oh, that's so cool. I got plans, guys. I got plans for future merchandise. Um, and the thing is, I never do merchandise for money. There was somebody that said, to, I read the comment, and he was like, Beaver, you're making two pound per plushie, and you've sold 1,500. Why aren't you selling them for more? Like, I get you're trying to not make profit, but from a business perspective, you can make so much more money. <laughs> and I'm like, yeah, you're right, but I don't want to make more money. Like, the reason why I merch I've got merchandise is for anybody who wants it. And I, I don't want to make it expensive. It's never been that. 
when it was on Spreadshirt, um, I sold it for, like, I got, like, one pound for whatever, because I wanted people to have the opportunity to have it if um, if they really wanted it. I like how they slowed down that animation, the, uh, the Kool-Aid roll back and... Eh. I go for four, and he's always got one block, but I think it's... Yeah, it's definitely enough. Whoopa! And that's why you level up Tapajellosaurus. Out of any hybrid you get, first, if it's not a common hybrid, um, if you are going to save up for something good, get Tapajellosaurus or Carnaraptor. You will still use them at high levels like me uh, when you've maxed out the level, which still has never, <laughs> has never clocked up. I thought for a Christmas present they would update it to make it 80. Because I just want, I just want to level up, please. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, so we got lots of carnivores. And I mean, lots and lots of carnivores. But I kind of want to put Pterodostro in just to scare out that Flaffy. Then to put in something to completely KO um, a Dilophosaurus. Oh, Majungasaurus. Look at this. They, they kind of make all the dinosaurs even. But look at Majungasaurus. The, the commons are way better than the rares. Um, Majungasaurus, level 1,254. 1,900 attack. That's crazy. Um, I don't want to use any of those just yet. Uh, in, th in case things go bad, I can't use a carnivore. Um, really, I need a flyer. Uh, so I'll put in Pterodostro. Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay, scare him away. I'm going to have to go for a block, actually, because I can die in two hits in case he doesn't get scared away. And this Pterodostro, I need to spend 100,000 VIP points to get it maxed. Uh, sorry, to level 30. Uh, so if it's in the lorry, you bet your ass I'm gonna try and win it. So my this team, my hopes and prayers lie with Prestosuchus. So he goes for one. I think he had two, didn't he? So he's got one block. Oh, he has two thousand attack with five, two kill. Oh, two doesn't kill you. Interesting. I'm gonna go for a block here. Oh, he didn't even go for it. No, oh, no. Which means he's gonna have four. Um, he, he's gonna kill me. Yeah, he, he's gonna kill me unless he switches. Please switch. No, oh, you little buggy, you. Oh no, the game's over. <laughs> I should have went for a reserve. Okay, uh, solid. Just go for four reserve. I mean, if we're gonna go out, might as well go out swinging. Oh, you know, risking the biscuit. And it's over. Okay, good, good job. Thank you. Um, I misunderestimated that team. <laughs> Really did as well. That was bad. Um, so, I'm tempted to put in uh, Antar Antarctica Pelter. Just to force in one of their switches. Super Kool-Aid to clean up. And um, one of the Metriophobodons. So go for the reserve. I don't even care. You can kill me if you want, but you might switch out. Oh, no. He killed me. <laughs> Damn it. That's not what I wanted to happen, damn it! Oh, I'm an idiot. I should have went for a block. I'm gonna die again, aren't I? Right, well, we've survived. You can't kill me in two. Well, you can't come in one. Oh, he, he tries it, though. Ooh, you cheeky buggy. Ooh. Right, two block and then three reserve, which means he can't do anything. Well, he can't kill me. And then Metrophodon can... Oh, he, he's really... He's going all out. So aggressive. But he's got nothing now, and I can kill him in three. Uh, and then I'm going to go for three block, because they're going to have possibility of four, and even then they still can't kill me. So Super Kool-Aid is going to do this single-handedly. He's probably going to die in Majungasaurus, though. I think he's going to. Depends what Dilophosaurus does. Ooh, he goes for two. Okay, he's got two block. We kill him in two attack, so we have to go for four. So one reserve, four attack. He does go for the two block. We've killed him. Bam! And uh, Majungasaurus can kill me in two hits, so he's going to have to go for three. Not bad. We didn't even need Metrophodon. We just needed a, a fairly decent um, a fairly decent amphibian. I think even Prion Suchus or uh, Sarkasuchus could have killed him here. Yeah. Like, I c yeah, there's no point. Metrophodon didn't even need to be in here. That's my bad. We could have easily killed him without it. But that's okay. We're going to win a legendary pack as well here, folks. Oh god, my voice. <laughs> I'm going to be dead for this next video. Good lord, it's going to be a silent, the first ever uh, fish video that's got no commentary. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to put it in Tiny Colosaurus. It's probably going to switch in something. My, it may even switch in a Lanqua. Um, 
I'm just gonna go for carnivores here because they're not weak to anything and they've got the advantage against Paki Sabinosaurus. So I'm gonna go for one reserve straight off the bat because he's gonna switch out instantly. Yes, make the mistake, you fool. Ooh, silly Aqua, you're going to die. Go for three. Soprano Titan's not as good, is it? I think it might have, like, the same attack, though. Does not have the same health. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. Be prepared. I'm going to attack you with my fluffy tail. Go on. What you got to do, son? You what? You want to fight, son? I'll kill you. There you go. Welcome to the Game Beaver channel, where we are stereotypically British. Go on. Stick him up. I'll kill you. <laughs> oh, we got him. Awesome. Wallop. But Tanikulosaurus is probably good a day. So yeah, I bet there's loads of you guys like, yay, finally Jurassic World video. <laughs> Making us wait, how dare you, you anti-Santa Claus. Oh yeah, it's got the same about, it's about the same attack. So he's got one block. So one, two, three, four. Factor in that one. He might have two, actually. He didn't even go for it. Okay. Pagasavlosaurus. So the attack changes from 2,387 to 959. Can still kill me with three hits, though. So he's probably going to go for four. And that is it. Yeah, we did it. Rock Hamster killed Soprano Titan. Brings in Quackers, the fluffy buddy. So just go for all-out attack here. Yeah, he's definitely dead. Nam. There you go. No, enough quacking for you. No, no, no. 50 DNA. Two more. On to the semi-final. Uh, ooh, my Microbosaurus. Interesting. Interesting. I'm going to put in a Patasaurus. And then, because, you know, we've still got Gorgosuchus Metrophodon, I'm going to put in some of the higher ones. So I'm going to put in... Uh, ooh, now this is interesting. If I put in a Patasaurus... He's probably going to switch in his Monolophosaurus. So then I put in Ostoposaurus. Ostoposaurus dies. Then Indominus Rex sweeps. How about that? It's either that or Metrophodon. I think I'm going to put Metrophodon in. Because it's got the advantage against uh, Microposaurus. And there's no herbivore on the team. So I can go for the reserve. Um, he could still do a lot of damage. He can't kill me in two. That's how good a Patasaurus is. So I'm going to go for three. Um, oh good, he wasted him. Oh, I love the way he just sits there and doesn't really move much. I like it. Oh, swaps in. Uh-huh, to be expected. Goes for one. Ooh, boo! The Panasaurus! It's okay, though. Hold your ground. Do not attack, because you can't do anything to it. Monolophosaurus is really good, actually. Like, stats-wise. Oh, it's dead. Okay, I think it went for an all-out attack there. That was three. So, Ostoposaurus comes in with 3,000 attack. Can kill it in three hits, I think? Two would be close. Yeah, three hits. Uh, go for four reserve on one block. Because it doesn't matter if Ostoposaurus dies here. What matters is that Metrophodon has eight. And they waste all their goes trying to kill Ostoposaurus. We die in two. Oh, switches out. 4,380. <laughs> okay. Oh, it goes for it. It's got one block. Um, is it worth it? Is it worth it? You know, it's worth a switch in. From 984 attack to 3,700. We're getting 3,000 for one turn. May as well waste that switching it out. Go for two. It kills it. Factor in the one. Four reserves. Didn't even go for it. Bam. This is the semi-final. This is pretty tough. One, 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 one. That's not level two. Is it level 255? It might be, actually, because it's a legendary. Uh, ooh, what's it going to do? Goes for, goes for it. Why? <laughs> Couldn't even kill me. And we're going to get the 8 from Metrophodon. And that is you, deed. Oh, it might have been the uh, Indominus pack, because that's gone now. I'm not, I was not wasting, I know it's Christmas, guys, but I'm not wasting 100 quid on an Indominus Rex pack, just for a guaranteed Indominus Rex. Not doing that, not worth it. I've already got, like, how many Indominus Rexes do I have? And I got them for free on the Trade Harbor. I got one, two, three, four, five. I got five Indominus Rexes on the Trade Harbor. Why would I spend a hundred quid to buy one? <laughs> Although saying that, the game has been fixed, so they're now no longer on the trade hub, but still. Um, so, Tapajellosaurus, Prion Sutures, and Prytrodon. Uh, ooh, okay, this is a pretty tough team. Um, oh god, Indominus Rex, Gorgas Sutures, and we need... Ooh, the register! <laughs> you know what? If Gorgas Sutures takes out Prion Sutures, 
We should be good. We should be good. Um... There's just nothing else, is there? Oh, okay, right. Well, here we go. I'm not confident. I'm not confident with this. Um, I'm going to go for one block because it can kill me in two hits. And Indominus Rex, please survive. Right, that's good. We can take one hit. Please go for one. Oh, I go for one. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay, we're going to have to go for two block in case he reserved. He didn't, though. That's that's okay. We just need Gorgas Suit just to have eight. And for Prime Suit just to waste all its goes. Okay. There's one. Come on. Come on. We got three reserves. Sod it. I'm going to go for three here. Okay, he's got four. Go, don't go for two. Oh, it doesn't go for anything. Awesome. Yeah, there you go. Four reserve. Three block. Just to make sure he has to, like, waste a lot of goes attacking me if he does want to kill me. Uh, he can kill me in five, but I want him to go for six. Yes. Okay, there we go. We've won this. I think we've won this. It's still going to be really tough, though. Um, because Tapijalosaur... Sorry, Tapijalosaur is Tapijara. Is going to kill me. Uh, so I'm going to go for that and that. It's up to Rajastega, really. So Gorgosu just is the MVP here. Because without him killing Prime Suchus, it would have been over within like like four goes. Four rounds. Right. Now, he's probably going to kill me in two hits here. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Okay, this is it. This is where it gets... Oh, how much attack do you have? Only 1,700. Come on, Primal Rage. We got this. We got this, buddy. One, two, three... Four. Oh god, how much attack does a Prytrodon at level 80 have? It can't have more than 5,000. It can't. I'm gonna go for three block, one reserve. Do not have more than 5,000 attack. It might do though. Please don't. Oh, 4,100. It's close. Go for four. Yes. Okay, I don't think we can kill it in five though. Can we kill it in five? Please tell me. One, two, three. Four. Yes! Oh my god, we could kill it in four, actually. And there you have it. Oh my, the clutch. The clutch was real. And there you have it! Done! That's all my best creatures used in one video. Now I've got to wait a week for them all to come back. So what's in the legendary pack, guys? Let's have a look. 250 bucks, 1,250 DNA, the coin, and a Sarcosuchus. We spoke about Sarcosuchus. And of course, 1,300 VIP points, and they're the most invaluable, because <laughs> I need those. If you enjoyed this video, guys, leave a like. Thank you again for sticking with me for yet another year. And I will be with you, well, it's not, I'm going to be with you tomorrow and in maybe an hour, <laughs> anyway. So, I love you, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.